Hi everyone, hope you're well. This is D Boss. Just doing a video for uh, my friend Tyke. Uh, just wants a few tips on the uh, the hog strategy. So uh, I'm currently in the Clan War League, uh, Tanor Eleven. Uh, it's called Team Privilege. That's it. So let's have a quick look then. Uh, do, 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 where are we? I think it was War Six. It was that one. Yeah, Chaos Theory. Right then. <clears throat> Before it all starts, you want to look to see if it's actually a viable strat because it, it does not work on all the bases. So the things that I look for are can I get both heroes or at least one and if the second one needs to be right at the end of the base because what you don't want is it following around massacring your hogs. The other thing I look at is uh, value of the kill squad because at least an Inferno or the Eagle Artillery. So when I looked at this space, I mean from the wall wrecker, you're either going to come from this angle here at sort of 7 o'clock, you're going to come from around the 9 o'clock, or you're going to come from the 10 o'clock area. So if we look at down here, okay, the funnel's pretty doable, and that's the other thing to look at as well. You need to look at funnel, because if you can't get a decent funnel, it kills it from the outset. So it's doable with a funnel, you're not guaranteed to get both heroes. You might get the king. Uh, so it's it's got potential. If you're to come from nine, it's got a long, long way to go with a lot of defences. A lot of defences before you get to the king. Uh, if you come from eleven, very similar to seven, but the heroes are more gettable. So I decided to actually come from this way with the hogs coming round uh, from this side. Now, after you've decided which one is the base viable, that's the first thing, to your entry route, the things you've got to consider is after the kill squad's gone in and kill, got the clan castle and some heroes, which way are the hogs coming from? Now, one thing I've seen people do wrong is they just think it doesn't matter and they might come from this side. You want to get the eagle. Absolutely crucial you get the eagle artillery first. So the things you look at, viability of the base, as in can you get the heroes and is the funnel for hogs going to be good afterwards as well, something didn't mention. Um, is the funnel doable? And looking on from that, the next thing you want to look at is, okay, we're coming from this side, it looks doable, how are we going to funnel? So it's not the same, it's like with every, with every other base, you don't just put golems down or ice golems or wizards and just assume it'll work. You can do it, it might work. So I looked at this and I looked where the uh, air defences were which and the archer towers. I thought to myself, there's only one. If I put an electro loon on here, because it's so heavy HP, it'll take out a few things around here. And then if it goes that way, I'm not too bothered because hopefully we'll take out some of this. But the funnel's created, so that's fine. And if it goes this way, even better. So I decided on an electro loon here for this side. And what I'd always do is put down a loon first, uh, just to get rid of any seeking air bombs. Um, oh, is that the same tune I've just had on? It is. Let's put a different one on. Sorry about that, Tyke. And then the next thing is, okay, how are we going to funnel from this side? Uh, and I looked at it. Air defense, bit too close for another Electro Loon on this side. So I actually thought I'll put some Giants down this side and some Wizards. So let's see how it played out. So there's the Loon. E drag to create the funnel. Wizard up there, just uh, save a bit of time. Here come a couple of Giants to start the funnel. I always save two or three Wizards for cleanup. So these Giants are purely to stop the inferno melting your wall wrecker because you need your wall wrecker to get through to about here and again each base is different now I knew it would be a problem so I brought a freeze with me which I'll drop here you want to rage fairly early on obviously poison for the clan castle and use the ability fairly early on you want this kill squad to stay alive so as you can see clan castle's going down heroes are both dead over half the health on the wall wrecker at this point I'm not really bothered, it's achieved everything, but I'll put another rage here, because I always come with two rages, and get some value out of the wall wrecker, and like I say, bowlers come out. And then as soon as the heroes are dead, come in with your uh, your hogs. Now, obviously there's certain things you can't cater for, like straight away, there's the tornado trap. 
so don't always pre-guess where you're going to put heals because you could have double giant bombs as well now I had a freeze which I said I was going to use up here I never did uh, that was the initial plan that's why you've seen it used down here just to give these guys a bit of a break uh, and like I say the heals as and when you need them so initially I was going to do one here one here one here but they split up not as I was expecting to be fair so I get, like I say, don't pre-drop your heals assuming you know what's going to happen because you can have Teslas drop up and all sorts of stuff can go wrong. As you can see, the Queen's still alive. I think I put a wizard up here just to, uh, or down here, I can't remember now. Everything's dead. I think we've got about half a dozen hogs left. 25 seconds. I think there's about another 30 seconds on the actual wall left, uh, hit left. There's more than half a dozen. So that's it. Pick your base. It won't be, it won't be perfect for every single base. You need to be able to get the heroes, a good funnel afterwards for the hogs. You need to be able to set the funnel up because if it fails from the start, it's over. And then just uh, yeah, plan accordingly. Now, just looking at the uh, the layout, I'm quite heavy on the uh, the funneling troops. There's 30 there, 25 there. So that's, so that's 60 plus and then before we even get to the kill squad I always think you can do it with 26, 28 is fine you don't need any more than that just to give you a rough idea and this is a spell comp 3 heals, 2 rages and that in your clan castle that is it, I hope it helps you matey and uh, good luck using it in the future see you soon